Welcome back to another quick soundbite from the Compare Lawrence podcast, your local source for all things Lawrence, Kansas. We're here today with some breaking news about our beloved Jayhawks. I am your host, Brian Reynolds. Sports Illustrated has just reported that there has been a significant development in the Kansas men's basketball infractions case. Uh, after a long investigation, the NCAA's Independent Accountability Review Process, IIRP, has downgraded the severity of the five level one allegations against our program to a level two case. As a result, the team has received a three year probation, but get this. Their postseason status remains unaffected. That's right. Our boys will still be hitting the court come tournament time. Head coach Bill Self and assistant coach Curtis Townsend, who were initially faced with level one violations, saw their charges reduced to level three with no additional penalties. Um, the court has spoken, and it seems like they believe in our coaches as much as we do. Here's some context for those unfamiliar with the case. It was one of the last infractions cases still open from the 2017 federal investigation into uh, corruption in college basketball. Uh, the case was arguably one of the most high profile of all investigations resulting from the FBI probe. Alleged violations included payments from Adidas representatives to people associated with former Jayhawks, Billy Preston and Silvio D'Souza. Um, but now that this chapter has closed, we can look forward to the future. We are eager to bring on the new season and continue the proud tradition of KU men's basketball. So let's rally behind our team, Lawrence. It's time to move on and keep the spirit of Jayhawk basketball alive. Uh, until next time, don't forget to sign up for our newsletter. Stay up to date on all things Lawrence, Kansas.